With the release of 1.2, we added something to this one that we've been asked for for quite some time now, and that's Storyboard for the Mac. So this is your first look at it, everybody. Um, if you've been using Storyboard, it looks very familiar. If you're new to it, this is uh, our Storyboard suite here. Um, down here you can see an application model of all our different screens and looks. This is our main window where you can actually see the storyboard of our entire user interface. We can also come into here and say edit layers to see all the layers that these screens are composed of and how they're made out. So you can see all these two. Um, we come back to our, our main view here. You can see down here we have our properties view just as always actions, variables, um, the, all the different images that are involved inside of our product. Um, we can easily drag and drop any of these out, and add them, move them around to our UI, align them with different controls. Um, so all the functionality that you're used to already inside a storyboard, um, all the layers for particular screens, animation manager. So all these pieces are still there and most importantly the simulator is still there. So with Mac you get your own custom simulator for Mac OS and just as always you can easily run validate your UI design decisions you know see how they look and feel when you actually run them on your system um, you know check to make sure everything's as anticipated um, so as we said everything that you got on either our Windows or our Linux versions are still there um, one other thing just a quick first highlight of this feature and we'll probably do a more in-depth dive is one thing you may have noticed if you're paying close attention is there's now a notes section on our uh, on all our controls screens uh, the application you can leave notes to uh, what this control is what it does anything that's not sort of easily explained or you think deserves more attention um, they'll be stored inside of our piece. If you looked at our last video that just came out on our collaboration, they'll all be noted inside there so you can see them. If notes have changed, they will be diffed against the SVN repository. And where these notes are taking us into is in 1.2, you'll now be able to come in here and say, I'd like to export the storyboard design notes. And from here, you can actually export either a PDF or an HTML. And so I'm going to take this document here. I'll say export as HTML in my local directory. It'll export it. I just need to do a refresh. And now my design notes are right inside of here. So I can actually, from one click of a button, what you saw there, well, might have been two or three, um, I've exported all my screens, my actions, what the screens are made up of, any variables that's used, um, you know, and a complete sort of design document for my project. I can now export and send to other people who might be interested in this, you know, whether it be project managers or other people in the company who this is uh, pertinent information to. So I'm sure you get the idea and you'll probably want to look through it in deeper detail, but the nice part here is all your notes will be brought out inside of here. So as you work and build up your prototypes and your product, you can easily generate your UI design spec uh, from inside of there and verify that everything is exactly how anticipated. Anyways, thanks. I just wanted to make that quick and let everybody see what's coming in 1.2. We're very excited about this and uh, everybody get your Macs ready.